हाय फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू द वॉक थ्रू ऑफ इजी पास डॉट ई एफ सी एंड इजी पास इट्स अ रिवर्सिंग प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम हैक्टा बॉक्स एंड इट कंटेन्स ट्वेंटी पॉइंट्स तो लेट्स स्टार्ट बट बिफोर स्टार्टिंग लेट्स सी व्हाट द ई एक्स सी फाइल डज सो दैट वी कैन हैव एन आइडिया ऑफ वट द ई एक्स सी फाइल इज सपोज टू डू so when we click it uh, it prompts for enter password let's put some random password let's say positive okay so when we put a wrong password it prompts us with this uh, wrong password okay so that's the way the exe works so how to get the correct password uh, let us reverse this uh, exe and i'll be using immunity debugger for this so let's open the exe file and see what it does so um, let's view the easy pass module and this is the assembly of uh, uh, instructions uh, for the exe file and uh, there are lot many instructions and uh, what we can do is uh, we can search for uh, we can search for all reference text strings and let me increase the font okay so here uh, there is all strings which were referenced these are the strings ascii and these are the sorry th these are the strings and uh, what i did okay these are the strings and uh, these are the um, hexadecimal addresses uh, where the strings are stored so we can search for that uh, particular string wrong password here so uh let's search for wrong password let's see what we get search for text uh what it prompts is uh, so it prompts wrong password and i'm searching case sensitive that's why it wasn't working so if i remove this case sensitive uh, i'll get the reference okay good we have uh, two strings which uh, are looking interesting so this is good job congratulations and uh, uh, probably that is the string which uh, we will get that will the message which we will get when we enter the correct password so let's try so when i enter this uh, i reach to the code where this string was used so here the string is the string is moved into accumulator and this eax is accumulator extended accumulator that's why e so Um, what we can do is uh, we can see this jump instruction and um, this jump instruction this points to this memory address and uh, if we double click it uh, sorry if we click it we move to here that means uh, it is something like a uh, an if statement in um, in any language so this is like a if statement and if this jump is taken we move to here it means the password is wrong and uh, if the this jump is not taken that means uh, we have entered the correct password and it prompts us with um, good job congratulations so that means this call function this could be the one which decides uh, uh, whether the password is right or wrong and uh, set up some flag in um, set up some flag so that 
this jump instruction can decide whether to jump or not so what we can do is we can set up a breakpoint here uh, and by double clicking this portion uh, a breakpoint is set and this blue region this indicates that the breakpoint is set and uh, what the benefit of breakpoint is uh, um, whenever program reaches this portion the program will stop execution and uh, here we will get the status whether the program is paused or running so let's try to run the program all right so we run the program and here is another big point so i'll again run it and the program is running and uh, i've got this sorry this was uh, a previous so i have got this uh, let's enter some wrong password okay we have entered a wrong password lol and uh, when this function is called we have lol in our accumulator and uh, this seems interesting this sk string for train which is stored in uh, the register edx so let's uh, move to this function all right when we move to this function uh, we can see that here we move accumulator to um, esi and uh, this edx which contains this string for train uh, exclamation mark this is moved to this register di and then the two registers edx and ex are compared and uh, if these are same uh, we are jumping to this this address that means we are jumping to the end of the function this is the end of the function and what is it is doing is simply popping the, the registers and returning that means uh, if uh, sorry where i was okay so this means uh, if this jump is taken that means if these two registers are equal we are uh, returning from the function and uh, this means uh, that uh, uh, if the password is for train uh, we might be if we enter for train and uh, the edx register also contain for train we might be able to get this jump and uh, return from this function so So if these two are equal, we are uh, directly moving to here and we are returning. And when we return, what happens was, uh, when we return, uh, when we return from this function, uh, here is a jump instruction and uh, this is, uh, this jump is uh, taken. That means, uh, for train, this is the correct password. So let's try uh, run exe and enter for train to see whether this is right or not for train exclamation mark and if we check aha we got a good job congratulations that means the right password is um, for train so that's it for this video thanks for watching and if you like it please subscribe to my channel at myrelgoss thank you very much